Okay. This here is going to be the... Uh, something... Or the Depraved Trinity. Yeah, the Depraved Trinity fight. Uh, fighting them on my Marauder here. Or specifically my Juggernaut, who's uh, unstoppable. Can't be stunned and is all but immune to slows. It's unbreakable. Uh, life regen galore and uh, some damage reduction. And then show you what else I got. Uh, single target is double strike. With, me, with stun support. Uh, life leech and multi strike. And then uh, my AoE is Ground Slam with faster attacks, multi strike, life leech, and fortify. And the reason I have Ground Slam in there and not Sunder, like uh, what everybody else seems to be using, is because um, I have two of these. It gives it a wider angle and um, has a chance to give me um, endurance charges. And then uh, my movement slash teleport ability is Leap Slam. With faster attacks and endurance charge and melee stun. And I believe um, this boss does summon ads, but only at uh, certain intervals throughout the fight. And then decoy totem with increased area effect and increased duration and then stone golem but he ain't gonna last long and then determination gives me some armor and then warlord's mark with blasphemy attached to it okay That's about all I can think of at the moment, so. At last, our trio joins to become. One. So let's let's hope my game doesn't crash, or or let's hope my uh, computer doesn't restart, or my game don't crash, like it's already done twice already.
guys, I'm assuming. Yep. Okay. Oh, apparently got it. And those of you who who have watched my uh, previous three sub boss battles. Those actually went a lot harder than they did this damn boss, which was, for the most part, a tank and spank. Especially the Sharon fight I did. I basically had to brute force my way through that one. But, but anyway, that's the fight. And looks like I'm off to Act 9. Or Act 10, excuse me. <laughs> 